So you might be trying to figure out how you can find your phone number on your iPhone. Now, luckily for you, there's a few different ways to do this, but I will tell you, if you do not have a phone number associated with your iPhone, well then clearly you're not going to be able to find one. So as long as you have a SIM card or eSIM installed on your iPhone, you should be able to do this. So what you want to do is you want to go ahead and make your way over to your settings application. So go into your phone, open up settings like you normally would, and you want to scroll down until you see a few options. So there are three ways to basically see your phone number on your iPhone very easily, and it's within these three applications, phone, messages, and FaceTime. So if we click on our phone panel, you'll see that as soon as I click on it, I have a few things that come up, but right here I have my number that comes up right here. Well, if you look closely, I do not have a number that shows up here. That's because I do not have a phone number, I don't have a SIM card installed on this iPhone. But if you did and if you were to, the whatever phone number is associated with this iPhone, you will see that phone number right here. On my personal device, I am able to see that phone number right there, so you should be able to see it here too. Well, let's say you come here and you can't seem to find it. Well, what you can also do is come down into Messages. So click on Messages right here, and you should be able to see under Send and Receive right here. You should be also able to see your phone number associated with this iPhone in this panel as well. It might show up here, it might show up somewhere else, but this is another area where you can go and see it. Swiping back out, you can also see under FaceTime where it says you can be reached at FaceTime at, and then it'll show you a list of things here too. Well, you can go ahead and see exactly what's going. You can see your phone number, you can see your email, you can see whatever other ways people can contact you via this phone number too. So that's another option you have as well. So those are a few different ways to do it. It's pretty basic, but that's pretty much how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.